Welcome back to The Breakfast. And uh, our final conversation this morning is going to be a follow-up on the uh, strike by the National Association of Resident Doctors, uh, of course, uh, which uh, should have started at 8 a.m. this morning, according to their uh, press release. We're going to be speaking live with uh, Jacinta Obiku, a Plus TV reporter, uh, on what exactly is going on this morning. Good morning, Jacinta. Thanks for, of course, uh, joining us and giving us this live feed. Good morning. Can you hear us? I can. Okay, great to have you. Quickly share with us, you know, where you are uh, this morning and what's uh, the situation on ground. Okay, so I'm here at um, Lagos State uh, University Teaching Hospital, precisely at the office of the president, Dr. Hassan Oluwafemi, and he has confirmed that the strike has begun uh, exactly by 8 a.m. this morning. All okay. right. So what else? And what he else? Also okay, go ahead, please. He agreed to, yeah, he agreed to join us live. I'm here in his office to uh, give the further details of the strike. Okay. L l let's speak to Dr. Femi then. Okay. Good morning, Dr. Femi. Thanks for joining us on The Breakfast. Yeah, good morning. Okay, so I'm aware the strike began this morning at about 8 a.m. So does that mean the doctors did not show up at the hospitals today? What's the situation like on the ground? Uh, well, just like um, uh, everybody knows that um, the Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors has given directive for all athletes to proceed on strike 8 a.m. this morning. And Lut being uh, a member, uh, so we have uh, complied um, totally. As we speak now, uh, members are not at their duty post as instructed by the, the Nigeria Association of Resident Doctor. So um, those that will be seen in the hospital may just be in the lounge, just relaxing and uh, chilling. So nobody will be at work today. Has, that, has there been any... That. Um, in the build-up, you know, till this morning, has there been any feedback from the government? Have you uh, gotten any word uh, to maybe convince doctors to share off this idea of a strike? Yeah, well, the truth of the matter is that um, yesterday there was a meeting, uh, but uh, the information we got uh, from the national uh, secretariat is that uh, nothing tangible has been achieved and as such. They plan to proceed on the strike, stay old, and that is why uh, we are on strike now. So what's the plan to cater for the patients who are on admission in the hospital while the strike proceeds? Uh, well, um, in the hospital, just like you know, that uh, resident doctors are just parts of doctors working in the hospital. Uh, we also have uh, consultants who work in the hospital and... Uh, Truth be told that uh, patients belong to the consultant in the hospital. So it is the decision of the consultant to decide what will be done to the patient while resident doctors are on strike. Okay, okay. Do, right. do you have any information for us uh, about your colleagues in other hospitals in Lagos if you know, they've also impacted on the strike? Yeah. And, um, the same thing that is happening in Lutz will also be, I'm very sure, it will get the same feedback in uh, Lassut, uh, which is also uh, under Nigerian Association of President Doctor. So the same thing in uh, Federal Medical Center, in Butemeta. So um, it, it comes across the whole nation. So as we speak now, resident doctor across Nigeria are on strike. Okay. All right. All right. Um, we, of course, we would love to speak with you again sometime today, hopefully, uh, to get, uh, you know, feedback on what exactly is going on. And if the government has made any uh, moves or, you know, there's been any further meetings scheduled to, you know, put an end to this. Thank you very much for your time this morning. Thank you again. Yeah, and yeah. thanks to you too, Jacinta, yeah. for bringing us the update. All right. All right, thanks a lot for joining us so far. It's uh, where we end the program for today.
Uh, if you missed out on any of the you know, details or the conversations we had this morning, of course, a very interesting conversation with uh, Obadiah Milafia, former Deputy Governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria. You can get with us on social media platforms at Plus TV Africa. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, same with our YouTube channel. And yes, trust us to bring you up the updates from the NARD strike across Nigeria, especially Lagos, uh, much later in our news bulletins. My name is Aneta Felix. Thank you for being a part of our day. The um, 1st of April. Yes, it is. And uh, we wish you a very, very beautiful month ahead. I am Musaogi Ogbawa. The news comes up next at 9 a.m.